Uh, Mr. Secretary, we'll do one more, and then we got to go to votes on the floor, and then we'll, we'll, we'll come back after that. Mr. Van Drew is recognized for five minutes. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Secretary Mayorkas, we stand here yet again to address a crisis that you've continued to make worse. As Secretary of Homeland Security, the American people have entrusted you with the security of their communities and the security of their nation. You have failed them. Our southern border has been turned into a revolving door for illegal immigration, drug trafficking, human trafficking, and threats to our national security. Is this the America we want? An America where every town is a border town? An America where our communities, infrastructure, and resources are strained under the weight of unchecked illegal immigration? We know the answer. Our constituents know the answer. The answer is no. The reality is that under your leadership, you've created the largest border crisis in the history of the United States of America. A crisis so badly handled that the international organization, and I want everybody to listen to this, the International Organization for Migration labored our southwest border as, quote, the deadliest land crossing in the world, end quote. Unbelievable for America. Are you aware of how many illegals have been encountered at our border and how many known gotaways have escaped into America? And I just want the numbers. Congressman, you speak of the... Um of the Southwest. Sir, border, I just I, want the numbers. And the, uh, the challenge of migration that we face. At Thank the you. I appreciate your answer. It's 5.6 million illegal alien encounters and 1.5 million known gotaways. How about the number of aliens on the terrorist screening database who have been caught? Not the ones who haven't been caught, but the ones who have been caught just in the last nine months. Do you know that number? I'm very pleased to provide that uh, to you. I do. It's 140. Thank you. How about the number unaccompanied minors processed in FY23? Do you know that number? Uh, similarly, Congressman, I'd be very pleased I, to provide. Thank you. I know that number myself. It's 152,000. We have seen a continuous surge of fentanyl coming from China, being distributed by Mexican drug cartels and destroying countless American lives. Are you aware of how many Americans died? How many Americans died in 2021 at the hands of fentanyl? I am aware of those numbers, Congressman. 71,000. 71,000 human souls. These numbers are staggering, and they are a direct result of your actions as secretary, actions that have dismantled effective immigration policies and broken the rule of law. Your lies to Congress and the American people that put American citizens in danger every single day. And in my mind, in my mind, this makes your actions criminal. All of us, all of this leaves us at a crossroads, a moment in time where our actions will define the future of the United States of America. This is a call to action, a call to restore sanity at our borders and safety in our communities, a call to ensure that every town in America is no longer a border town. In the words of Ronald Reagan, quote, a nation that cannot control its borders is not a nation, end quote. The time for action is now. Congress cannot stand by. So we arrive at an inevitable conclusion that I do not take lightly. Secretary Mayorkas, you must resign. Will you resign? No, I will not. I am incredibly right. proud of the work that is performed I understand. in the Department of Homeland Secretary Mayorkas, if you will not resign, that leaves us with no other option. You should be impeached. And I yield back to the chairman.